postman's been again, the postman's been again. I'm excited about this. Oh, and the other thing is, is ooh, the new Southport cards arrived. Ooh, ooh. Anyway, this I found on eBay. Now, cut a long story short. Um, a couple of years ago, it might be three years ago, I buy second hand fishing rods and, and I saw a fishing reel for sale which was uh, Stratic GTM and you got a fishing rod with, with, with it for free. So I got this fishing rod for free and it just sat there lying around and it was like just, just collecting dust. Anyway I broke it out and it was a, a 13 foot um, heavy <laughs> heavy um, feeder rod. There's loads out there, 13 footers that have all got the name on them. Cut a long story short, what I did is I bought this rod and I went, I looked at the build quality and I thought, you know, this is shit up there. Fucking eyes on it and everything like. They were fucking unbelievable. So I thought, so I tested it for on the reservoirs and, and it would perform. I mean, it would punching big feeders out or whatever feed I wanted any distance I wanted right well, I wasn't happy about the tips because the tips were a bit on the heavy side but massive eyes on them and then I had this idea and I thought you get all these rods we can babble and we've got babble rod written on them right and the Harrison tonics and all this sort of shite yeah, you buy in something that's got barbel written on it and all the playing action of a fucking barbel pole. So anyway, I tested the, one of these rods out on the barbel and fucking hell, it made mincemeat out of them. But not just making mincemeat out of them, it was a pleasure to play the fish on it because the action on the rod was absolutely um, from full action all the way through the butt, right? but still with that parabolic blend with tons of work left in it, you know, like to haul the fish in and it was just a pleasure to use. So I thought to myself, I'll get another one. Rare as rocking old shit. Proper rare. Just could not find one. Searching continuously, week, out, week in, week out, could not find another one found one eBay again and the last one I paid the equivalent of around about 20 quid for it I would have had I imagine I rate it I really rate it it was the most exciting find I've found for a long long time it really really was three piece first of all I'll show you the tips on them the tips are Amazing, you really are. Oh, god, he's, he's wrapped it all, all these tips up absolutely gorgeous, <gasps> right? But the tips, the eyes on them, they're fucking huge, they're massive, they're just massive tips as well. Full carbon, and they go up to for the river up to about five or six ounces. Absolutely, I, I, I mean. It was just a revelation, it was just like, why the hell would I, I use a fucking barge pole catching? And I, I tell you what, I mean, absolutely made mincemeat of them. Anyway, put those tips down. And um, you'll be surprised because you are not, I mean, I've been using these for a while. And uh, it's just the build quality on it, I, 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 the punching power strength in the bloody thing, everything about it, and I hate, you know, you know you need a Dutch master or something like that, or you need to buy this and you need to buy that, and I'm passionate about my fishing, and I try to give, and it's, it's identical, absolutely, that is the first book section and there's not an eye on it, not a single eye on it. It's quite a short handle for, for the what's name for the, for the river, which is absolutely perfect. Um, the carbon quality on it is, is amazing, but 
notice no eye on that first first section power and the distance I was pop, popping out uh, fully loaded six ounce feeders with one of these right um, not even took not even bending the rod and hitting the far mark on the opposite side of the river uh, as if it you know like he was just like oh my god um, yeah I'm a bit passionate but just the build quality on these is, is just superb. Nice big double leg eyes on it. Absolutely unbelievable. Proper spigots. Proper spigots. None of that shite. Proper spigots. Yeah. Unbelievable. Double leg eyes all the way up. Pure strength. And the name on it you would not believe and um, they're not they're not modern they're not modern and this is in, in mint condition it's absolutely perfect and you would not believe the make on it and it's a mather it's the mr3 and they are a work of art 13 foot big river barbel rod i have two of them now these are a work of art proper lockdown through your real seats in them these clamp up tight believe me i've got exact identical identical real seats on these and a very similar handle to these on my tricast xrs's and my legends and they lock in tight and you know what the carbon on these is a fucking work of art um it's really 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 well designed um and these are impossible to find it's 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 a freaking mather mr3 13 foot heavy power feeder absolutely my recommendation for the river if you want a 13 foot rod which will punch five six ounce feeders as far as you want fully loaded right that's my recommendation not a harrison torix or or a fucking something that's going to cost you a freaking fortune right hunt around for stuff like that try and if it's shite i'll give the stuff away you know what i mean i'm not i'm, I'm what's the name they're just not designed properly try them you punch them you don't go i can put a feeder on that i can genuinely say if i really wanted to fucking whack out a feeder well in excess of 150 yards this is the rod for me it'll do it these paid 60 pound for this one 20 for the other pair of cart rod well barbell rods big chuckers this is my choice i love them absolutely gorgeous massive eyes on those two, on those all of them massive anyway 13 foot powerhouse, 60 quid. I'm happy. You should be happy too. See you later.